Hey, hello guys. So guys, uh, today I am here again with you. And today I am going to tell you very important things. Please watch the video till the end. You will find many tips and techniques and very necessary things about the internet. Many mistakes, what we do while we are using internet everyone use internet but everybody doesn't know about the security about the the things what they are uploading what they are uh, using on the internet because you know nowadays there are too many hackers they can hack very easily your personal information, your data, your credit card information. So in this video, I will explain you about all these things. So let's just start. Guys, the first thing, the first uh, uh, tip you can say, I will tell you about the HTTP and HTTPS. Many people doesn't know what is the difference between HTTP and HTTPS. You use many websites and you see before the website it's written HTTP. Okay, but you don't see it's written HTTP or HTTPS. So first I tell you what is the difference between HTTPS. See, HTTP means Hypertext Transfer Protocol. This is the protocol who take your request to the server and bring the the reply from the server and HTTPS means hyper text transfer protocol secure so if you are using any of the website any of the bank account online or an, um, any social media website and you see if it's written HTTP so don't use that website see HTTPS because this is secure and uh, in this HTTPS nobody can hack your account or nobody can uh, hack your information personal information your ID password so this is very important and uh, many people just open the website anywhere and they start to share information or if they have to transfer some amount or they have to pay some amount for example for the billing they start using so be careful about this because hacker can hack easily your information if you are using HTTP website so make sure you are using the website with HTTPS The next mistake what you do, everyone do, uh, especially on Facebook or the other social medias, um, how you will look like when you will be 50 or who loves you too much or this type of post. Okay, so this post is very dangerous for you. Because when you use this application, the application asks you the information about you, about the context, about the city, about the different um, information. And you just click allow. You don't read this and just uh, you see um, the interesting application and you just click allow and once your face come your image come in old age or in young age you see this is very interesting oh i will look like this and after that you share with your friends and family so this is very dangerous anytime when you see this type of post or you are going to use this type of post so first make sure which type of information you are giving 
for this application which type of information you are clicking on allow don't click on allow without read the data because if you are giving your information all your information all your context so the hacker can hack very easily and he can misuse your account the third mistake what we do if you have different social media account so don't put the same password for each account yes make little bit different or choose the different password what you can remember but don't use the same password because if the hacker hack one of your accounts so he can hack all your accounts with the same password so this mistake many of the people do and they see the result when the hacker hack their account guys now uh, the next mistake usually the youngster do 14, 15 or also the adult people do the same mistake. They use 18 plus. They see the, the picture 18 plus images or video or any application and they stall from Play Store or Apple Store and they try to use it. So this is a big mistake because the mostly hackers use this type of application for hacking so please don't follow don't use these type of applications and try to keep your information id password secure guys if you want to secure perfectly so remember one thing in social media in whatsapp facebook in gmail use two factor authentication enable these two factors authentication so your account will be completely secure in whatsapp you find in the setting two factors uh, authentication in Facebook and other social media also you use uh, these two factor authentication so your account will be completely safe because if you are using internet banking or the personal information what is important and yes sometimes you don't use the two factor authentication so the hacker can hack very easily your all information, your ID, your password, your account information or whatever. So please use this two-factor authentication. Uh, one other mistake, uh, what especially I will say for the girls, don't do this mistake if you are going to uh, anywhere or the coffee shop or with your friends not only girls girls and boys both so don't share with your life location because maybe somebody keep his eyes on you where you are going what you are uh, doing uh, when you go somewhere so he can misuse all these information so it's better you can use that information later when you come from there but on the same time try to keep your information secret so if you are sharing the location so share the location with only friends keep only friends don't use public so go anywhere enjoy but don't share your location with public so I'm not saying do all these things and but uh, this I am telling you because this is for your security you do or you don't it's your life but all this information I am giving you because this is very important for the security 
Okay, so the next mistake, the next mistake we do the free Wi-Fi. See, nowadays nothing is free. So if you are going somewhere and you find, okay, this is free Wi-Fi and you start use it. So the hacker open the Wi-Fi and he give the access for everyone and when you use it you share your information all the information goes to the hacker so use your personal Wi-Fi or personal mobile data don't use free Wi-Fi everywhere because it can be trouble for you your mobile can be hacked or your all the information can be hacked because nowadays people see oh this is free okay now they start using so keep all these information in your mind and after that if your friend you know the guy who opened the Wi-Fi for you or who shared the hotspot with you okay otherwise don't try to use the Wi-Fi in public places Maybe in, in the cafe or in any restaurant you are using free Wi-Fi and the hacker can hack all the information about your bank account and your personal information. Because again I am saying nowadays nothing is free. There will be some reason behind that. So be secure. So guys the last mistake for boys and girls do they share their personal photos and they suppose they are chatting with someone only three four times they chat it and they start to trust on them so don't trust anyone and don't share your personal information with everyone because you don't know how he can misuse in the future and you know all these things so guys these all information for today I will continue this information if you did not subscribe my channel please subscribe my channel and keep watching my videos share with your friends thank you for watching take care bye